should be awesome as awesome. All right, let's load this up. End of sesh. Okay, when last we met our intrepid heroes, we found a cursed crown. The crown of the Magister. Which is what this game is titled, Celeste, the Crown of the Magister. And, uh, yeah. It's, um... It causes our character cr a great pain if it gets taken away from him. Um, so they basically, uh... The council of the town basically said, all right, well, it's yours. And we had a vision. It gave us a vision. And uh, we have to f follow where it's trying to lead us now. And we also got a couple of side quests we might take a look at too. Yeah. Lone Wolf says, I think I might get this on Wednesday. It's great. I'm having a great time with it. Yeah. Okay. Conversation recorded. Is anything? Let's see. The last conversation. Uh, where I have to do a alright let's just look at our quest log okay so this is the main quest travel to the place where the crown bearer is being drawn to and search for a gem the place is called the dark castle though that doesn't sound very welcoming uh, we also got a side quest from Arwen Merton who is Ko's character uh, he's the voice actor for it um you did find you did not find out much about Arwen uh, Merton, but maybe something will come up if you really did used to be famous. So yeah, we have a couple of side quests. I think we did. Um, I think we offloaded some of our inventory last time, so we can just jump into uh, our explorations today. All right, anybody else in town have a mark over their head? I don't think so. So let's head to the town exit. Okay, possible gem location. That's right, we have a, we have a gemstone in the middle of our crown now. So we're gonna try to find the others. It's like the, inf the infinity stones. Okay. Um, there is a two after quests here: Sorak Relic and Honor Your Masters. Okay, Master Dakin at Carelem. Um, that's right. One of our characters, River, has a side quest here. All right, so it's on the way. So let's go. We'll go back to Carolem a third time. The journey begins. <clears throat> By the way, Bog, I really like those gray stained shelves. They are pretty. Did uh, Azaria share something? Oh, oh, cause Fizz was on it yesterday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I said I did a lens post. Yes. We got surprised. A group of hostiles has managed to surprise you. Well, crap. Gonna have to lurk while I do some work in the garden, but I'll be listening. All right, Thorny Subject, enjoy your gardening. Yeah, we should have, um, we should have our dining room and living room up there, uh, back together by Maybe this weekend, we'll hope. Oh, these guys are toast. They have 11 hit points. What are you guys thinking? What are you thinking? Are you still with us? Yeah, you rolled a 20. Come on now. Alright, that was the surprise round. Round two. Alright, now I can go. Oh, you guys are so dead. You guys are so dead. Okay, this is the big tough one. Let's try to hit the big tough one. Take that. Okay, you're not so tough. Ah, oh, as soon as I say that, I missed. 
Okay, we're gonna go. By the way, my party for anybody that's just tuning in, we have a ranger, a wizard, a rogue, and a cleric. Uh. <laughs> I didn't mean that. It's a good thing he missed. That wasn't the plan at all. Burning hands. One foe down. <laughs> One foe? You can't count. That was two foes. Okay, Azari is here. Um, okay, we'll switch to the rapier. Fine. And he's dead. Or she's dead. Really? Why would you guys surprise us? You could have lived the rest of your little bandit lives. That one hit the dirt. That one flew into the trees. <laughs> what are you guys thinking? There. There's your chance to run away. Doink. No quarter given. That's right. Can't trip. Ray of Frost. Oh, it's too slow. Uh, too far. Cancel. Walk up here. That's take. You did one. Come on. I know it was a cantrip, but still. Kill him. There we go. You lose. You lose. Oh. Really? <laughs> yeah, it hit me again. Uh, you started playing this on Game Pass. You're loving it, Kimbalina. Yeah, for anybody who uh, has got Xbox Game Pass for PC, this, ga this game is included. It is included. So that way you don't have to spend the monies. All right. Anything here we need? I'll bring the rations. I'll bring. I'll take the monies. I'll take the dwarven primrose. Chainmail, huh? Okay. There we go. You must gather your party before venturing forth. You must gather them to and fro. Leave the area. Okay. Strange Shay, you're the beginning of your second playthrough all halfling dwarf team on Cataclysm difficulty. Oh, nice. How's Cataclysm difficulty? Is it brutal? All right, party's on the move. We oh, Azari found an apple tree. The party gains five food. Bog read the chapter of a book. It's difficult. Thank you. Thank you. That's very specific. All right, here we go. Our third, our third journey into Carolem. Carolem. I love this uh, ominous uh, music on the loading screen. Clear oh. skies, friend. Clear skies, deputies. Um. <laughs> why? Why did we immediately go into talking to this guy? How's business been since we? cleaned up the place. Not bad. Some folks are starting to explore a little further. Though this Sorak attack still has people nervous. Still, there's been no sign of them since. So, we mostly pretend it didn't happen. Ha! <laughs> oh, good for you. <laughs> we mostly pretend it didn't happen. Hey, Rabbit, what's up? Okay, quest board. Oh, this is the scavenger expeditions. 
Okay. Oh, there's one that was complete. Click on item to recover instead of selling it. Nope, sell all. 72 gold. Okay, that's it. That's pretty groovy. New Dan Luck, how's the game? Is it worth buying? If you have the Xbox Game Pass for PC, it's included, but absolutely worth buying, New Dan Luck. Very, very fun. They put a lot of love into this game. It's a really uh, fun interpretation of the uh, fifth edition SRD rules. Feels very pen and papery at moments. Yeah, there's a lot to love if you like CRPGs. All right, now we have, we have to meet Master Dakin at Carolem and explore the Temerian Tower. So where's the tower? All right, he's up here. So I guess we'll go do that one first. There he is. Okay, so this, this is what I like. I created all four of these characters, right? The character created, they're all custom characters, but they gave certain characters uh, side quests. Like River all of a sudden found this guy and it's like, hey, that's my old master who taught me magic. I was like, what, he did? Like I created you, I didn't know that. All right, let's see all about this. There you are. Are you ready for this? I am. Any idea how to get up there? One or two. I tried to think of a way, but still, this place is incredible. Did you notice that there was a minor gate just here in the courtyard? As a matter of fact, I did. Let's get to it, if you don't mind. Let's do it. All right, we gotta enter the tower. A minor gate, where do the adults enter? What is this Mogo the Poor, a general store for adventurers? How funny is that? I think we're okay though, let's just go to the tower. You wanna, you wanna stay in the tower? Then follow me. <clears throat> I found one gem, Eldrin. Regal Peach, the wedding was awesome. We had a nice trip. We uh we did a like a a two hour recap of all the things. So if you're interested in lots of detail, check out the VOD of today's stream a little little later. So is that guy not coming with us? New Dan Luck, I feel like they should not have made the decision to zoom in during the dialogue since they didn't focus on detailed animations. All right, so here's my real quick little uh, story about this. The devs kickstarted this game and they made decisions based on the budget they got for that. And they have been very outspoken about what they focused on. They focused on a faithful representation of the pen and paper rules of fifth edition SRD. And they focused on uh, the gameplay, how the combat works, um, you know, the spells, the tactics, all that kind of stuff. So what they were able to focus on and accomplish is impressive and it's super fun. But if you're, if you're here for the smoothest animations and the best like character models and all that kind of stuff, then yeah, you're not going to find, you know, top notch, triple A voice acting animations and that kind of stuff in this game. That doesn't take away from the, from the fun in my opinion though. Yeah. Um, yeah, they don't have, like, every single class either. You know, there's going to be Sorcerer coming out as a free DLC, but, you know, it's missing some of the classes. Hopefully, and it's their first game, hopefully, um, Undignified. The, the game does well enough that they can continue to, uh, make games like this and... 
I would I'd be excited to see what Tactical Adventures comes out with. Yeah. Yeah, it's a small team. Bog, track this quest. You're going the wrong way. Okay, thank you. Which one is it? It's uh honor your masters. Track quest. I'm an idiot. This yeah, isn't it. This isn't the tower. Too. Hey Ellie, what's going on? Thanks, Allie. Look at that. I just I just wanted to go in there for a second. Because it's fun. Alright, track quest. Okay, so I talked to Mr. Man. Uh, we gotta go in the tower over here. Oh, they want us to get up there. Well, that's a whole nother ball of wax. Find a way into the tower. If you can reach it, you'll be able to drop a rope for others to climb. To get there, however, you need to fly or Word something. Acclaim spreads. We need to fly or something. Oh my goodness, we're getting raided! We're getting raided from Comark... Co... What? Core maker, core maker TV. Is that who it is? Did I say that right? Thank you so much for bringing your community over. I see Uni Krudra, Kadoff, Bauer, T Gerer, Shade sixty four, Guevara. Hey, what's up? How you doing? English only, please though. English only. Hi, Dusk Wolf. The army of the North has arrived. Let's plunder. I love it. I love it. Otters, fight back with your charge emotes. We're being raided. Um, I see Exo. Exo's here. Hi, everybody. Okay, so uh, Core Maker was also playing Solasta, Crown of the Magister. How are you enjoying it so far? Core Mocker. Is it Core Mocker? Would it be an old Icelandic name? Oh, nice. Am I saying it right? Korm. I'll call you Korm. You're a huge tabletop role-playing... You know, so you're loving it. Okay, yeah. Absolutely. I love these type of games. Anything that reminds me of playing D&D is great. Well, welcome to the stream. Thank you so much for raiding. It's uh, it's awesome to have you guys. My name is Richie, a.k.a. Bog Otter. I'm a full-time variety streamer here on Twitch. I love all kinds of games, but specifically fantasy RPGs are some of my favorites. So if you enjoy Solasta, you'll be welcome here. Um, we're the home of the Otterman Empire, so I refer to my community as Otters, and we have some of the best Otter emotes on Twitch. And uh, make yourself a company. And if you were watching my stream, do me a favor and go and check out our new friend Korm stream using the link that our mods put in chat. And... Uh, Hit that follow button. Let's support the uh, the stream uh, the streamers that support us. Yeah. This and Pathfinder, Wrath uh, of the Righteous, and Baldur's Gate Three will be my jams this year. Mine too. Mine too. I've recently started playing uh, Kingmaker. A couple months ago. And yeah, I'm gonna be checking out Wasteland Three this week too. Yeah, it's all good stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Tigera, is that an otter? This is ot. I like that. I like that. <laughs> yeah, a little bit cat off. A little bit. <laughs> I know it does. It seems strange, but yeah, it works. All right, so we just got this quest from uh, our our master here, Master Dakin, to go check this uh, place out over here. But we're gonna need to be able to fly. First, I'm assuming spider climb wouldn't work. Do I have a way to fly? I may not have a way to fly. Um, does Misty Step work? Let's save it and figure. Let's save it and try it. Misty Step. I don't think Missy Step works. What if I'm standing over here when I cast it? Misty Step, anyone? 
Anyone? Mm, no. Do we have a spell scroll? Maybe. I'm not. I don't know if I have a fly scroll though. Scroll of Misty Step, Burning Hands, Revivify, Scroll of Sleep, Fireball, Lightning Bolt, Haste. Oh, I do have a scroll of fly. Well, look at that. There we go. We got it. What level is fly? Oh, I can't scribe it. Okay. Spell level is too high. Okay. So let's do it. Uh, Corm says, we just finished that place so I can hang a bit before going for groceries and not get spoilers. Good. And please don't spoil anything for me unless I specifically ask chat. I talk to myself a lot. I go, oh, I wonder what that means. I wonder what that is. Don't answer those. If I need help, I'll say, chat, please help me with this. I don't know what I'm doing. So that's, that's in general how things work around here. Uh, cast flying. Let's do it. Flying dwarves. Oh, flying dwarves. Now the rope is there and everybody else can go. So by the way, some folks were asking before that awesome raid, um, you know, is this game any good and stuff like that? And, um, you know, it doesn't have the AAA budget like we were talking, but it simulates some things in a CRPG better than like the AAA ones. And I think the fact that they use verticality, climbing, enemies will attach themselves to the wall. If you cast spider climb on yourself, you can climb up the wall and shoot from like hanging from a wall. That kind of stuff is fantastic in this game. Yeah. Levitation, fly, spider climb, uh, misty step, the spell jump, athletics checks, climbing checks, all that stuff matters in this game way more than other CRPGs I've played. Yeah. Thank you for following on Twitter, Corm. Fantastic. It looks like, well, another world. You must have seen so much. I have. But this I is have. still fascinating. Well, I see where you got your passion for learning. Let's look around. Gather all the antiques we can. Rob the place blind. Anything that's not nailed down. All right, so we have an NPC. Master Dakin is in our group. He's a critical character. If he dies, the game's over. Okay. Quick, kill him! No, that's a, exactly what we're not supposed to do. Oh! Undignified, but necessary. Oh, he's still flying around. I love it. I absolutely love it. Oh, there was a chest over here or something. A box. Oh, we can push it. My dwarf looks terrifying. Well, he's a snow dwarf. And he's flying, so... It's kind of interesting. Can they jump? <laughs> I don't know, is there a point even going up here? Uh, maybe. I'm impressed. Oh, that was a dead, is that a dead body? Yeah, it looks like a dead body. All right, get down there. Save before we... Oh, can't save now. What about now? Okay, there we go. Wait, who am I missing? Oh, the old wizard? <laughs> Somebody's missing. Oh, he's there. Oh, yeah, he's... <laughs> what are you doing? Dude, come on! No path? What are you talking about? He doesn't have the... Uh... <laughs> Does he not have the athletics to make it? Oh, 
come on. You're being silly and everyone's watching you. Oh, uh, yeah, look at this. He won't, he won't jump there. Hmm. They said they fixed the beard, but looks like not. I think they said it was a known issue. I don't think they said they fixed it yet. Yeah, all right, we're gonna check out this dead body. What do we got? Three superb javelins and a primed longbow. So primed uh, weapons allow you to enchant them. These were probably already magical. That's why they're superb. So we'd have to identify them. Object revealed. All right, let's push this thing. <laughs> so this looks like a book, but I can't interact with it. Okay, fine. <clears throat> oh. Okay. All right. Master Dakin, let's go. Anything else we missed? Okay. By all the gods, <laughs> this is really something. It explains the library we found down in the caves. Place seems dangerous. How so? Definitely. Be ready for a fight. How so? Wait, you, you know me? I don't fight. He's the one that taught us all these powerful, aggressive evocations, and yet he doesn't fight. Okay. All right, the underground cave leads to the bottom of the tower and the library. Get in there and recover what you can. All right, I feel like... I wanna sparkle this place up. One, two, three! Sparkles! That is awesome. There's another one over here. Must light all lanterns. And, oh, a battle starts. Skeletons, where? Oh, wait, how did, why did my dwarf go down there alone? My wizard is down there alone. Whoops. All right, prevent the skeleton archer is attacking river. I can cast shield. All right, cast it. Oh God. Ow. Ooh, that was a crit. Master Dakin says, I don't fight. And he's right, he has no ability to really do anything. Okay. I don't even know how I did that. How did, how did my wizard go down there alone? turn. Of course, uh, shooting a bow at skeletons is not going to be amazing. Hey, still did eight. Still did eight. Okay. She can actually come down and still take an action. So let's do that. I'm gonna make our guys come over. 
Kill him. Nice. That one's dead. All right, these guys aren't too tough. I feel like we're a little over leveled for these guys too. Um. Oh, that one shielded. Wow. Wow. Okay. He casts slow? So at least a fifth level caster. Right? Slow. That's terrible. Okay. down here. Uh. Yeah. Edot says, uh, Bog, do you even remember what the master said before? What, about him not fighting? Yeah, I remember. He's still flying, so he moves faster. But if you meant something else, Edot, then maybe I did forget. Um, Okay. Turn on dead? Doesn't go far enough. We can only get one, this one guy. I'd rather just shoot my crossbow. Floop. Come on, you can do better. Miss. Uh, Corm, thanks for following, by the way. And Unicruda, about 15 minutes ago. Thank you for following. Should I prevent this one? With another level one spell? I'll let this one hit me. Ah, see? Worth it. Only three damage. There's another one. Deal with it. Okay, Master Dakin. I don't fight, but I will come to your rescue anyway. Hold firm. <laughs> You've endured worse. <laughs> Shove him. Knock him prone. Huh. <laughs> that did about as good as I thought it would. All right. Um, jump down here. That was fantastic. Nice hit. There you go. Ten to the bean. Ten to the bean. Really? Oh, that's right. She's slowed. I'm like, really? You can't get all the way up there? Oh, crit. Nice. Masterful. Wow. She did 26 damage there with that crit. Oh, no worries, Corm. Just being here, just raiding. Amazing support. Thank you so much. Okay, so... I don't think we need to spend too many resources here. I'll get you yet. <laughs> I missed at that range. That looked hilarious. I like the action cam and everything to watch me miss. Good. Chill touch. Missed. You should have fled. There we go. Oh. Wizard is about to die. All right, cast the damn spell. Shielded that one at least. Okay, Master Dakin, uh, now you gotta get the hell out of there because now you're really wounded. Run away. All right, attack. 
A wizard. You have them now. Ooh, he resists that. Okay. Should I focus on the psychopath caster? I don't know. Let's see if we can take these little ones out. Nine. That one's almost dead. Okay. Gonna be using a lot of spells right away. Let's send two of those that way. One this way. Yeah, let's do three here. <laughs> Take that tree. Wow, he did shield on. Okay, it still almost killed him. Azari is now cold and hindered. Let's cure. Eleven. You are a valued comrade. Okay. And let's have him start coming over here. You should not let the wizard be a frontliner. Hey, he's a dwarf. Just throw him out there. XCOM rate would be 99% hit, but never misses. Yes. That's true. Did I turn up the AC again? Why? What am I forgetting that I did? Ow. Uh. Oh, you said as was cold and hindered. <laughs> I thought you were talking about the air conditioning from our trip. <laughs> the one that made the weird noises. I was like, did I make a weird noise? All right, this guy just sits here. Sit there and look pretty. Kill him! Zarya! Finish him! Nope. That was a miss, miss, miss. Okay. I wish the, um, the initiative order, or the turn order on top changed as people kept going. I keep looking in the top left going, oh, it's the skeleton's turn, but then I look down here, I'm like, oh no, no, it's, it's my wizard's turn. You know? I wish it would, like, cycle. There you go. You got this. Cantrip for the win. Nice. Move. nice. That's beautiful. All right, pup. Let's go. Let's go crack some skulls. Oh, come on. That was your time to shine. He's dodging. <gasps> Alright. Where did I go with my ranger? Ranger's over here. Let's hop up here and say hello. Hello. <laughs> well struck. Do it again. <laughs> oh man, you goober. All right, let's take out the rapier. Uh. Killed him. Whee! Uh. 
It's so you know the whole battle order and plan accordingly as it doesn't change between rounds, I guess. Well, you can still do that. Like, I forget which other games does it. Maybe Pathfinder? I'm not saying, like, I'm, I mean, keep the whole order, right? Keep the whole order. I think Divinity does it this way. But let's say it's the skeleton's turn. He goes, so the skeleton would go all the way over here and go to the end of the round. And then everything else would move to the left. So you can still see whose turns are coming up, but it would just, you know, it would rotate. So you'd always have to look to the top left to see whose turn it is. I don't know. It's just a minor thing. It's a minor thing. All right, pup. I don't think pup can get over there with the mace, so I'll have to crossbow it. And a miss. Thank you. Thank you. Good. Keep missing. Ranger danger. Take that. Take that, scum. Uh, Corm, you would share some basic importance in uh, battle since this is based on D&D. Oh, I'm familiar. I'm a dungeon master in 5th edition D&D. I run a game for my family and my, some of my friends. Been a long time D&D uh, &D player. Um, if there's something that you think I'm completely missing, feel free. But I think I have a good handle on what's going on. Um, I should have shoved him off. You uh, like it? Either way. Okay, we did it. Let's see what happens now. Are you all right, Master? I'm alive, <laughs> or so it seems. <laughs> seems surprised by that. Those are quite common in the marches. Just tell me there's something valuable down here. Oh, I think you'll be happy. We found rations. <laughs> um. Okay. Let's pick up some loots. Short bow. All right, let's take the arrows. I should probably, you know, I'm gonna use my ranger heal on our NPC friend. Okay. And everybody else seems okay. Shoving is the best mechanic. It's so much fun. Better links. We'll take the arrows. Okay. I'm gonna leave the heavy stuff. The scavengers mechanic is is fantastic. The the uh, the guild that comes in. And picks up uh, your loot after it's safe and gives you a percentage of what you left behind. I think that's fantastic. I wonder if there is. Why are these sconces on sideways? Did this did this tower collapse? The whole tower is sideways? Oh, interesting. It's like an Escher painting. I think this piece of loot here I wasn't able to get. Loot it! Loot! It's a triple. 
Okay. Alright, these books are nothing. Um, so there's, there's no path over here. Well, I guess we might have to cast Misty Step. Actually, does my ranger have... I think jump? How far does jump go? And what would be the shortest? Oh, we can go over here. Alright, what was this? Oh! Flaming Bolt? Okay. Crafting five times Dark Stab Poison Bolts? Crafting recipe. Okay. Hey! Crafting a Scroll of Ice Storm? What you doing? I, I want to see if you need anything, if you're doing okay in here. I'm kicking ass. Yeah? Not really, but yeah. Looks pretty cool. Yeah. Did you, uh, any luck with the table people? I forgot to call. Oh. Okay. We almost have a brand new TV stand, though. Is that what you've been doing? I'm going to yell at you so bad. I hate when she tells me, like, things she knows will upset me while I'm streaming. <laughs> I literally told her before the stream, like, this is the priority today. Please, this. And she, of course, does not listen and does other things. The TV set looks so great! No! Yes. No! That's yes. not what the focus is today. I know! Okay, can you please go to work? Yes. Go to work, please. Okay. Thank you. Yes. There we go. And you didn't even call about the table. Call about the table and work. Sorry. <clears throat> you already have two TV stands? What are you keeping track of how many TV stands I have, Rabbit? Actually, we don't have two TV stands. We have. Well, now we do. Now that she built one, but yeah. Um, okay, let's let's see what this stuff is. Crafting Scroll of Ice Storm. Beautiful. Crafting Dagger of Sharpness. Scroll of Mage Armor times two. Scroll of Ray of Enfeeblement. And a Scroll of Haste. Nice stuff. Nice loot. Okay, so we picked up everything there. Alright, I don't even need a jump spell. There we go. And this was the loot of the skeletal mage. Leather armor. A quarter staff. Now, it doesn't say that it's magic. Could it be magic? Or would it say something like it's superb or wonderful or magnificent or anything like that? Yeah. Oh, it was a big thing you got the extra one and didn't need to return. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, you're right, Rabbit. I'm sorry. I misunderstood what you're saying. That yeah, We ordered the TV stand. They sent us two. We still have the second one. We we asked them what to do. They said, just keep it. So we're like, okay, we have a second. <laughs> it's still in the box, though, in the garage. Yeah. We got to figure out if somebody needs it or we build it and maybe put it, like, <laughs> on Facebook Marketplace or something. Yeah. Oh, you never heard that story? Yeah, Marauder. We we ordered a new TV stand, and they literally sent us two. They got they got delivered like back to back. We were like, huh? So the first thing you do is you panic. You're like, I can't believe we ordered two. But then we realized we didn't order two. Yeah. Don't build it. Someone will buy it in the box. Okay. Yeah. It would shine blue around it if it had magic to it. All right, thanks, Corm. Scroll of Bane, Unidentified Potion, Spider Venom. Wow, lots of stuff. And I can knock this over. Huh. Beautiful. And can these wigglers jump across now? 
Go, guys, go! There we go. Okay. Um... I already know this crafting option. Okay, so if you already have a crafting recipe, if you already know it... Do I just sell it? Scroll of Bane would be for Pup. Scroll of Mage Armor. Crafting Scroll of Ice Storm. Read that. Okay, it needs an Emerald, a Matacolin Orchid, Storm Heather, and Angry Violet. That sounds expensive. At least we have the recipe. Crafting shagger. Sh <laughs> the shagger of darkness. How about the dagger of sharpness? Uh, you, you never know when you need to craft a shagger. Prime dagger and a blood ruby. That's an unidentified potion. And spider venom is a healing? What? Oh, it deals one to four poison damage. But it heals 2d4 plus two? You like that, Shagger of Darkness? That's good. Typo, I think. Never tested it. All right, let's test it. F5. Quick save. Who's got it? All right, so she's at 26 life. For science, drink the spider venom. Yeah, heals. It heals. Huh, interesting. Reload that. Good to know and weird as F. I know. Mmm, delicious spider venom. Yeah, it might be like, it might be linked to the wrong uh, effect. But who's gonna argue now? All right. Uh, do you need to scribe this? Scribing takes forever, right? Scribing takes time. I should do that later. But I can cast Identify as a ritual to identify this potion. This only takes 10 minutes. Potion of Speed. Okay, sweet. All right, I'm gonna give that back to my ranger. You like how skinny my dwarf is? Yeah, he's he's a wizard. Wizard needs food badly. All right, I think we're good with this section. Let's go to the next. This is more than I dared hope for. So much more. Good. I think the guild will treat you a little better now. They lick your boots for a look at these. Ew. I'd like to see them do that. One or two of them in particular. <laughs> these will be perfect. Take whatever else you want. I have plenty. And thank you. You're welcome, Master. I think it's time you stop calling me that. You know? Well, how about Chairman of the Guild, then? With these books... Stay in the light. My friend. How are you gonna get them back? You too. 500 XP! Nice! Okay. That's pretty good. Okay. So this is all he wanted. He wanted all these dirty things. All these dirty little books. Alright, gang watching. If you uh, played through this... 
Anything I'm missing besides some of these skeleton bodies? Uh, Army of Optimus uh, says, maybe there's some really benevolent spiders out there. They wrap you up in webs just to keep you toasty warm, heal your wounds, and send you off a some hot chocolate. You know what? I think we can all agree those would be pretty cool spiders. We call those grandma spiders. Yes. That's about it. Okay. Awesome. Let's go. All right. I don't actually... I don't need to walk out, do I? Let's go here. Hey, cancel. We did this. Empty armor stand. Oh, wait, no. There's a chest over here. Oh, yeah. I, I missed this. Okay, always check your map before you leave, I guess. Piles of money. All right, we got an amethyst. Crafting basic poison arrows and a whole bunch of gold. I like gold! Isn't that weird? Yes, leave area. All right, we have one more, I think, side quest here. 